It's morning. And I know you didn't have your dinner last night. Shut up, said Buck. She's coming back. The end. Well, that's it, Mrs. Blunt. Once more, I'm under the wire with rent money assured for the next few months. Why, you know I don't worry about the rent money, Mr. O'Henry. I'm proud to have you for a tenant. You mean I don't have to pay any more rent? Well, not exactly that. The reformation of Calliope. Calliope, in that case. Calliope? What's it about? A merry-go-round? It's about a bad man, a sheriff in a Texas town. That's Cal Catesby, the bad man. Well, he doesn't look so bad. He was, though. Kept a whole town buffaloed. Until that fellow in the other picture ran him out. Well, he looks mean enough to do it. Takes a mean man for a job like that. That kind of meanness is something you don't put on and take off like a straw hat. Men like Buck Patterson lives so close to the edge of trouble that it becomes a necessary part of his life. And if trouble doesn't show up anymore, he's liable to go looking for it. Sounds like he should have reformed. I think they both did, Mrs. Blunt. Though things might have drifted along as they were for quite a spell, except that Carol's younger brother decided to go on the prod. Jug of molasses, charge it to me. Thanks, Buck. You think that shot was really meant for me? If it was, it'd hit you. It's Johnny Catesby. He's in the Longhorn Bar. I'm a bright eyed, bushy tailed snorter with a ring in his nose. Out of the brush on payday. This town's dying of reform, and I ain't to take it apart. To start with, we're gonna. Let's have a little bit about that, Sheriff. I'm right proud of that gun. You should be. But you know there's a law against carrying, let alone firing a gun in quicksand. I've heard about it. Then why didn't you turn your gun over to me when you rode into town, like these other boys did? I knew you'd be coming after it, Sheriff. And I wanted to save myself a trip. Then just unbuckle your belt and slide it down the bar to me. I was figuring on a little whoop de do Johnny. You made a bad start. Let's not mess up the finish. <laughs> 